Today I'm going to be doing a Rebel Potions bath bomb demo. This one is the Crystal Ball bath bomb and she has it described as scented and bubblegum and dragon's blood. I definitely smell the bubblegum scent. It smells like juicy bazooka bubblegum. It smells absolutely delicious. Really pretty pink shimmers on here. So I'm excited to stick this in. We're going to see what it looks like. Alright guys, our crystal ball bath bomb is pretty well fizzed out. Just have a little bit going there. Holy crap, this bath water is so stinking pretty. We have lots of pretty bath art here on top and our actual watercolor is a really nice purple. That dragon's blood scent did start coming out after I stuck the bath bomb in. Uh, with the bubble gum, it made for an interesting scent paired together. It's got like a very sweet, earthy scent. Uh, I think it smells good though, and I love the color of this water. So I am going to fill up my tub the rest of the way and hop on in, and I'll be back with what I thought afterwards. I'm finished with my crystal ball bath bomb. Not a whole lot to clean up in the tub. There's some shimmer down there, some shimmery glitter, and just a little bit of color. Um, some of that glitter did stick to my skin though, and this was a moisturizing bath bomb. I still smell the scent lingering on my skin. It was a mix of that bubble gum and dragon's blood, and I would just describe it as a sweet, earthy smell. I thought those two scents together were interesting, not like a combination I've ever really heard of, but I thought they went well together. I like that kind of scent. I love sweet scents and I love earthy scents, so to pair them, I don't know, I thought it was a really nice smell made for beautiful bath water as well as bath art. So overall, I really did enjoy this one. Let me know what you guys thought down below. If you're not already subscribed, just hit that button and I will see you next time.